let us assume that the first uh, odd positive integer is x. So, let first odd integer is x. So, the next uh, consecutive odd posi positive integer will be next odd integer will be x plus 2 since we know that uh, any uh, two odd integers are separated by two term 2 so now in the question it is given that sum of their squares is 290 so according to the question i can write x square sum of uh, sorry square of uh, first positive integer plus x plus 2 whole square which is square of next odd integer equals to 290 so from here i can write x square plus if i expand this uh, bracket i'll get x square plus 2 into 2 into x plus 2 square equals to 290 or i can say 2x square plus 4x plus 4 minus 290 equals to 0 so it will be 2x square plus 4x minus 286 equals to 0 or i can say it will be x square plus 2x minus 143 equals to 0 so, to find the value of x, we shall use the quadratic formula which states that if any equation is given as ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0, then value of x can be written as minus of b plus minus under root b square minus 4 into a into c divided by 2a. So, if I use the formula here, I will get x equals to here if i compare with this equation i'll get value of a is 1 value of b is 2 and value of c is minus 143 so if i use the formula here i'll get minus of 2 plus minus under root b square so 2 square minus 4 into 1 into minus 143 divide by 2 into a which is 1 so value of x would be minus 1 sorry minus 2 plus minus under root it will be 4 plus 4 into 143 will be 572 divided by 2 so i'll get value of x will be minus 2 under root plus minus plus minus under root it will be 576 divide by 2 or i can say minus 2 plus minus under root under root 576 value of under root 1 uh, under root 576 is 24 so it will be divided by 2 so value of value of x can either be there are two cases first is value of x equals to minus 2 plus 24 by 2 or second case is x equals to minus 2 minus 24 by 2 so from here i'll get value of x would be 22 by 2 or i can say 11 and from here i can write x x will be minus 13 so since in the question it is given that both the odd integers are positive that means I will consider only value of x equals to 11 and I will not consider x equals to minus 13 since it is negative integer. So, if x equals to 11 which is first integer, then the second integer will, next odd integer will be
will be x x plus two, so which is eleven plus two, or I can say thirteen. So this will be our answer.